What's up everybody? This is Lord Batsy, and I think I promised I would make this video about two years ago, so better late than never, right? Um, this is a tutorial on the sound-based menu glitch, or menu skip, or menu exploit, or whatever you'd like to call it. Um, for Chrono Trigger, Jets of Time, oh, it might work in the vanilla speedrun too. Jets of Time is, of course, the randomizer, which you can check out at ctjot.com. That it's really, really nice to get a heal between Lavos 2 and 3. Those numbers on screen are not changing unless I do something about it. So we can uh, use this exploit to open the menu and heal. But the timing on this particular instance is kind of tricky. There are a couple other spots in the game where you can do this exploit. But what Common Wisdom will tell you is to wait until the screen turns completely black and then to open your menu at that point. And when you put in your menu input, you want to press and hold X because it gives you a couple extra frames of input to hit the menu on the correct frame where you can get this exploit. That said, the cutscene that comes before it is in, is completely consistent. So once the music starts, the animation is already going. And so the instant that you can press your X button to open your menu will always be consistent in terms of the music. So the Lavos 3 battle theme is pretty fast. So there's a specific note that I like to press my X button, my menu button, to successfully execute the menu glitch. I'm gonna go ahead and play this for you slowed down. So what you're seeing there was two measures that were repeated. Um, the music will start, so that's the first measure, the first note of the first measure. And when the music starts, the screen first goes to white and then it goes to black. And around when it goes to black, the note that I like to hit my button on is that one, the second note of the second measure. So do, 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 press and hold. Do, 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 yeah. Um, some people that also use this glitch do have, I guess, a different perception of it. And sometimes people will tell you that note is absolutely the one to go for. I definitely have had better luck with the second one, but that said, um, the way my hands work, the controller I'm using, the emulator I'm using, the et cetera, the hardware I'm using, these, these could all be different from what you're using. My ears are different from yours. So the main idea behind this trick is that you don't have to do it exactly how anybody else does it, but because the music in that scene is 100% consistent, you can probably find an audio cue that works for you. Trick in action. Be ready to get some of these helpers. Music starting. Press! And there you have it. Um, I think that sound is a great way to do this trick, again, because it's 100% consistent. And again, if what worked for me doesn't work for you, that's okay, because you can find your own way. Until next time.